So this is what I have left of my fall decor items. I'm gonna go around the house and see what all I can do with this and then come back and show you what I came up with. So I think I've decided what I'm gonna do with this little bucket. I have like five of them. So taking one and painting it, not a big deal. I'm gonna take it outside and spray paint it a creamy white and then fill it with some of the um, balls that I got from Dollar Tree and then some of the burlap pumpkins and put it on my TV stand. I think that'd be super cute. So I'm gonna go ahead and paint this bucket with this Rust-Oleum paint. It's the Hammered Paint and Primer in One in white. And I'm just gonna do the bucket and see how that comes out. So now that I have this bucket painted, this is a bucket I got at Target in the dollar spot. It was $3. I got a couple of them because I thought they were so cute. So I painted this with the white hammered Rust-Oleum paint. So it's kind of got that look to it, maybe just a little bit of a shine and a little bit of a, see the little dots and stuff. I don't know if you can see that or not, but it's got like the little kind of, I don't know what to call that. Maybe just a little bit of texture to it. So I've got that painted. And I've got this ribbon that I think is super cute. I got this at the Dollar Tree and I'm going to put a ribbon around it and put a big bow in the front. This has nine feet, so that should be plenty. So I'm just gonna go ahead and open that. This has got the wire in it, so you can do whatever you want with it. Love this ribbon, it's so cute. I wish I had gotten more of this. So I'm just gonna go ahead and take the whole thing off because I'm, I'm gonna use this. Nine feet's a lot, guys, look at that. Nine feet's a lot. So let's just see how much we're gonna need for this. I've got some double-sided tape I'm gonna use to keep this from sliding down. I don't really wanna use hot glue because I wanna be able to take it off and redo it Hopefully this will be better than the hot glue. We probably should use the hot glue, but I'm gonna use this. That right there. So I'm gonna put a little thing of the tape right there to keep it from moving. Let's see how well I did on my length in the front. Okay, one's just a little bit longer than the other. That's perfect. Okay, I'm gonna put a little bit more in the front to keep it from moving, even more. A little bit right there. A little bit right there. Can I bring it up just a little bit more? This one's just a hair longer, so, okay. I think it looks pretty cute. Put a little double-sided tape underneath the bow to keep it in place so that it doesn't go flip-flopping all over the place. Get the other side back up. All right, that looks pretty cute. Snip this off just a hair because it's a little bit too long. I hate to waste it, but it's a little too long. All righty, there we go. Super cute for fall. This ribbon is adorable. You can take any bucket that you have and do this to it. So cute, love it. Okay, so now I'm going to fill it with some stuff. I'm gonna put some paper in the bottom of this so that I don't have to fill it with a ton of stuff. It just has the illusion that it's filled with a bunch. So I'm gonna just put paper in here. I bought these at the Dollar Tree. Back when the fall stuff started coming out, I got those. And I also have these. And I also bought these. So I'm just gonna put them in here and see how that goes. I'm 
I like those, but not 100% sold on them yet, you know? 